Hey guys, Mystery Tackle Box is in. Super excited about it, can't wait to get it open. Different little setup this time, I'm using my boat on the water. Took it into the shop, I'm having the controls replaced and the cables. It's old enough, it probably needed changed anyway, so I said, hey, let's just take it there, get them put new controls for the throttle and the uh, shifter. One thing you don't want going out on your other boat is, is your shifter. I mean, you, you don't want to get stuck in forward or reverse or anything, so had a little bit of play in it, took it in, getting it changed, and I have it back in a couple of days. So I thought I'd go ahead and do the video of opening the box here in the office. But like I said, super excited about it. This is the August 2015 box, and I, I, I get the Bass box. They usually ship it on the 10th of every month. It's the 16th today. I actually got it yesterday, which was the 15th, but it takes about five days to get to you. Let's open her up and see what we got. All right, the first thing we got in here, let's see what it is. What is the package thing? It says it's a Hoorag, the better bandana. Let's check it out. Oh, yeah, that's pretty neat. I don't know if it's UV protected or not, uh, but hey, it's still going to keep the sun off your ears, going to keep the sun off your neck. Still worth it. I'll tell you what, pretty good. The box is looking good so far. Let's see what we got. Let's find our little card in here. And this gives you an idea of your box. It runs down all the lures you have. Um, it gives you prices. You can see there the prices on it. On everything, it tells you what the value of it is and all that good stuff. And if you look at the very bottom, since these are all mainly the soft plastics are going to be your, your sample sizes. And so these are going to show the full price instead of the sample packs. Give me an idea. But let's start from top to bottom and see what we got. The first one is a spinner bait. Looks like it's a boy ducket spinner bait. Nice looking shad color. It says it's a flashy shad color half ounce spinner bait designed for throwing in open water with minimal cover. Oh yeah, look, got nice, two, two nice willow leaf blades, gold and silver. Has a nice long skirt so you can put your trailer hook on it and it's still going to cover up your trailer hook. Overall, nice looking spinner bait. And you can see here that's what you got the open water half ounce and this is you know of course we didn't get that one but that's the different uh second one he has is a heavy cover half ounce but i like it not too bad the next thing we got is the uh kari shad lipless and slow sinking shad bait featuring realistic bloody red flared gills stainless steel rattle and super sharp uh, mazoo hooks oh yeah nice chrome body has a blue ridge on the top of it. Let's open it up so you can see those flared, flared gills out. Let's see what they look like. I can see them in the package, but it would be better if we can get it open and look at it. Oh yeah, you can, see the, you can see the gills on it. Sharp looking bait, not bad. I like it. Well, that's it. That's the uh, the lipless crankbait. The next thing we got is the Super Jerky J. All right, that's him right there. Nice little jerk bait. It's got some nice joints in it. Let's open it up. Kind of a gold white color. Has good joints in it. Allow allows it to really pivot and move. So you're gonna when you're when you're popping it around the water, this thing is gonna, I mean it's really gonna react. So if you're pulling it, I mean it's it's gonna pop and, and you're gonna get a lot of action, a lot of vibration off this bait right here. Uh, this would be a good, you know, breaking, uh, schooling type bait. Uh, yeah, I tell you what, it's a pretty good looking color too. Not too shabby. Alright, let's see what we got next here. We got the pop shed. Where is that? The Z-Man. Ten times tougher. Let's see the Z man. Look at that guy. He got a nice um, popping mouth. You can chug it in the water, pop it through, pull it along. Uh, nice top water. Good looking color. Good looking bait. I like that a lot. You got one of them in here. Let's see. Usually it's a five pack. It says. And it, the five pack retails for $5.99. This one is $2. It says the Z Man Pop Shad. 
Uh, the innovative soft plastic surface popper sports a cupped face that pops, spits, and chugs along the surface for maximum fish calling attraction. That's not bad. I like it. I'm pretty excited about the box so far. It looks pretty good. We got some good colors. A lot of swim baits, I mean, because that's a lot of the forge right now. These fish are feeding pretty heavy on shad. Uh, next thing we got is a Super Swimmer Junior. A nice smoke gray color. Bruiser baits. Let's see what it looks like. Looks pretty good. Looks like about a three inch. You can do it weightless. You can probably do it weighted. It's going to be a very versatile bait. It's pretty, pretty thick plastic there in the core of it. The tail's pretty thin, but uh, you probably get several hook up on it, hookups on it before you got to replace it. And this is a four pack. Next thing we got is some hooks. Jimmy Houston hooks. Uh, Forge Needlepoint Technology. You got two of them, wide gap. I bet they're usually like maybe a four pack or something. Now they're a five pack. And they usually retail for $3.50, but these two are worth $1.40. But these wide gap hooks, you can use it on virtually anything we got in the box here on your soft plastic. And you can put weights on the swim baits or jerk baits to make them get a little bit deeper. Or you can just do weightless and you could use it on the, I mean, anything we have in the box for soft plastics, you can put these wide gaps on uh, with no problem. The next thing we got is, is dude wipes. Hey, if you got to go, you got to go. These guys usually get a 30 pack of them for $10.99, not too bad. Uh, you, got a, you got this little, uh, little package here, so use them if you got them, right? Well, that's all we got, guys. Um, I'm going to go out today. I'm going to rig these up. I'm not, I don't have my boat, so I'm going to go out my tube, my fishing tube. And super neat little thing. You know, so it's not a kayak, but you, use, you put little flippers on your feet, and that's how you how you move, uh, maneuver around and get around uh, the water. But a super neat little contraption and it's a fishing tube. I'm gonna take it out around some of the marinas and docks and fish around. But until next time, uh, we'll see you guys. If you guys like the video, hit subscribe, hit the little like button. You got any comments, ask me any questions on the box, I'll be more than happy to answer them. Till next time, we'll see you guys.